All right, so we're back at it. We're trying Palisades. We've given it, what, five days since our last report. I think we'll be good. It's been single digits for the past couple of nights down here. We'll see. We'll drill some test holes, make sure we're safe, but we've got ourselves a lake that's empty. Could be the New Year's that's causing this, but I don't see anybody else that's been out here either, so we'll see. <laughs> Somebody fishing over there off that point. Yeah, it looks like it, isn't it? He's getting fallen. No. <laughs> Don't you give me any bad omens? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think we're good. All right, so we drilled a couple holes. Ben is officially on the board. Let's see it, buddy. That's not bad. A little stalker Stock rainbow, rainbow anyway. Pretty little thing. Heck yeah. Hey, no more skunk, right? No more skunk. Wipe the skunk off. We're sitting here at Palisades. The storm's moving in, and Ben has hooked up. Not a lot of ice. Three inches, generous, maybe four. But hey, enough to have some fun. No, no sooner than he put his pole back in the water, Ben's got himself another bow. He's got the trick. What, you got a little paddle bug on there? Looks yep. like, yeah. Yep. Uh, you know, I had a piece of uh, man on it. Oh, perfect. Well, let's catch one that's, uh, that's a monster now. All right, I put my rod down for what? Five seconds, got a hit. That's what we like to see, even though they're just little planter rainbows, but we'd rather catch some fish than not. How you doing over there, buddy? I'm just using pink. It seems to be the color of the year. A little paddle bug on the bottom. A uh, little rat fink that's been torn apart that now I just have a little worm on. <laughs> Wax worm. Tanner's laughing because he caught about 50 fish on this rat fink and so I'm just wearing it out a little bit more. So we'll put this guy back in the water. Hopefully catch one of the tigers hiding out in here. Got him? Yeah, I got him. There you go. It's another little planter. But hey, get stuff big enough to measure, don't we? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Good little guy. Hey, that's three for the day for us, huh? Yeah. That's not bad. Tanner, how many do you have? Five. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll let Tanner uh, hold the pole so he doesn't get skunked today. This one's getting a little bite. Oh, is it hitting again? Outside, we got ourselves a pretty good storm going on. In here, we're we're catching planter rainbows. <laughs> got it. Yeah, buddy. That's. Get your pants, oh, he got it. Oh, that's a beaner one. Bigger than yours. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Way bigger. Oh, the pink paddle bug, huh? Yours With was a wax worm. Dude, look at how skinny that thing is. <laughs> Poor thing. Yeah, mine's way bigger. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> we got Ben over here handling a shallow rod. Got the eye, eye <laughs> the jaw jacker here. And then I just moved my rod outside of the tent just to get out and enjoy the uh, the snow coming down. It's actually a pretty quick action. Ben's up to five fish now. Looks like he might be getting hit again. <sighs> I've caught a couple, Tanner's got one, so if you don't mind catching the little planters, it's not a bad place to go. And you do have the opportunity to catch some tigers, so Palisades. We're now the only ones out here. There was one guy here earlier, and he decided to head out. Not sure what his luck was. We didn't get a chance to talk to him, but still a fun day. I was actually anticipating worse 
conditions due to the fact that had the low pressure moving in but these fish are hungry just be careful if you come out here the ice is thin got him got that's him? a decent one is it yeah i think in here. hey oh that's one to put on the measure board not oh, bad uh at least a little fatter than the other that actually does have some weight to him doesn't he yeah Hold them up for me. Nice, man. Not bad. It's got some meat to him. <laughs> Tanner with another dink. Hey, not bad. Seems like everything's been on a little pinky. Are you give me some bait? It is just stoned like crazy out here, though. Ben's got one in here too. This looks a little better. Oh boy! Better be a good one. I don't think so. <laughs> oh, just the dink. That's all right. At least you're catching them. Scared the living daylights out of whatever's on there. There's Ben with a double hookup. Oh, there you go. Still a little planter, but a little bit bigger. There's all we caught rainbows. I know. Where are them tigers? They must be a little deeper go <laughs> you get it that's my fish that's no fair i didn't even reel it i just pulled it up no fair oh that's a nice that's one. a good one that's looks like a cutty 16. is that a cutty or is that an actual rainbow uh, Cut to it? yeah it looks like a cutty well no it's a bow it's weird that's a rainbow? let's get it measured up man i think that's gonna beat your other one yeah you know where all the equipment is to get it all measured up? Yeah. Nice. That's a good fish, man. Of course. I think it'll be 16. Well, at least it's consistent, right, Ben? Yep. Fish after fish. That puts you probably about 10 fish, doesn't it? Eight. eight. Not Dad, bad. Oh, oh. You want to get it? You get it. Oh. Tanner just got himself a little bow out here. Not bad. Super colorful. Yeah, not too shabby, man. It's shiny. Brandon Ivory's been growing that one in his new shed. <laughs> Woo! The best part about ice fishing is the uh, the food that comes along with it. We got some, they're right here, Ben. Yeah, they're. they're right Taquitos on the grill. We're not doing it in the tent because we kept cracking the ice in there and the. Ice is sinking, so we all moved a little closer to shore. <laughs> so we might actually have to move the tent pretty soon. It's uh, it's getting a little wet. Oh, we just moved the tent. We moved the tent because the ice was sinking. It's one of those things when you're fishing on uh, shallow ice, that tends to happen. But caught another bow. Tanner's too used to bass fishing, so he's holding the bow like a bass, but. Good looking. Still having fun. Can't complain. Ben's got himself another one. We decided to leave the puddle and Ben's still catching fish out here. Not too bad. Just had the jaw jacker go off. Just... Get on the way down. Oh, nice. Good day. <laughs> <laughs> All right, final fish of the day. Look at that sucker. He's been eating all of Ben's minnows. Look at how fat he is. He hit that thing so hard, though. Look at that in there. What is that? That's another fish. Look at that. Something. Looks like feathers. Those are feathers. It is kind of like feathers, isn't it? No, they are feathers. That's my sixth fish in here. See, those are feathers. I wonder what he's eating with feathers. I don't know, a dead fish? A dead fish? Yeah, there's flying fish in here. Go clean up the rods, let's go. Flying fish. Well, Tanner's pulling up the last of the rods. I think everybody did pretty well. Ben had close to 20. Tanner's probably pretty close there. I had about half of theirs. Might have been, oh, 10 or 11 by the end of the day. But it was great fishing. No one had any problem bringing in the fish so palisades little sketchy as you can see some water spots breathing holes 
And of course the ice sank where we first started, but what, whatever, you know, we made it out alive. Just be careful if you come out on your own. Be cautious, drill some holes, bring a friend. You ready? Let's do it.